You got this. We, we know, know you do. We know our goals. We rep ourselves. Confidence to our core. Welcome to the Team Girls TikTok Challenge. In partnership with Suncorp, we are calling on netfitters to come together to perform and record a dance routine and challenge their female mates and friends to do the same. We're calling it the hashtag Team Girls Challenge and we're excited to invite you to join in the fun. To get you excited, we are offering a special incentive to our NetFit family to get involved. We will be judging the most creative video posted by a NetFit participant, scoring the opportunity to have an exclusive chat with one of the Suncorp Team Girl Ambassadors. How cool is that? Chatting with a super netball player? I know I'd love that. This exclusive NetFit competition is open to all entrants aged 13 years and over and anyone under the age of 18 must obtain consent from their parents or guardians before entering. Otherwise, we won't be able to accept the entry. You'll also need to have your profile on public so everyone can see your awesome dance. Be sure to include the hashtag NetFit and hashtag Teen Girls Challenge so we can see your video. In addition to being bound by the TikTok T's and C's before entering the competition, you must click on the link below and read and agree to the full terms and conditions of the Suncorp Team Girls TikTok competition. Alrighty, let's get into learning the TikTok dance. Alrighty, let's get started with the Suncorp Team Girls TikTok dance. Now, you know the chant, we know it really well, we absolutely love it. And in this dance, you're going to have two different people involved. So you can be person A, or if you wanna duet with someone on TikTok, you can be the person B. So I'm going to teach you both ways of doing the dance today so that you get to have the choice when you are creating your TikTok. So how it's going to work, because you have person A and person B, you're going to collaborate throughout this video. So you're working together and really having that team girl spirit involved. So what's going to happen to start off the TikTok? It's like we are one person. So both person A and person B are going to put their face together and one is going to be half of the face and the other person, the other half. So to start off, what's going to happen is you're going to come nice and close to the screen so that just your left side of the face is open and the frame of your uh, camera or whatever you're using is cutting you right down the middle of the face. From there what you're going to do as person A, you've got the bore nice and low so it's out of shot, I know you can probably see it right now, but it's out of shot at the moment. What you're going to do is jump back on hey! So nice and quickly so you don't want your feet too close together because you might stumble and fall getting back. Getting nice and low, ready to go, and you go, hey, and you look over to your mate that's going to be person B. Feels really weird when there's no one there, right? But there's going to be someone there to duet with you very soon. When you get to your hey and you look over, you're going to point over and say, you've got this. So you've got this and tell them like you mean it. Beautiful. With that, then you can be super creative with the ball. So throw it around your waist, put it on your finger. Let's try that again. <laughs> and then what you're going to do is you're going to pass out of shot to person B. So we know our goals and you pass the ball on goals. So the ball's gone out and then you're going to get back into position. So you're going to clap three times to get yourself nice and back into position. Now, the actual chant and dance part of this is going to be the same for person A and person B, but there's gonna be little creative parts that they do slightly different. But this part is going to be the same. So what you're going to do is go stomp left, stomp right, and clap above your head. And that is on we, ha, beautiful. And then from there is that you're going to clap down, clap behind the back of your hands, and clap back down to your elbows. And that is on team, ha. So I'm gonna show you really quickly. We, ha, team, ha. Beautiful. From there, we're going to stomp our left and flick to the right, like you're doing a really cool pass off. Look away almost. You know your coaches would love that. Stomp to the right, 
pass to the left. And then from here, you can be as creative as you like. So you can go up to the camera, swipe, you can even do a kick, you can do whatever you like, be super creative here. And then what you're going to do is do a power pose at the end, facing your teammate and looking at them over there going, well done, like they've nailed it. So just to be really quick, what you're going to do is just with the dance part is left, right, clap above, down, up, down, beautiful. And then you're going to stomp left, flick right, stomp right, flick left, come up to the camera, whew, do whatever you want there and then do your pose. And that is person A. Alrighty, you've learned person A and now it's time to learn the dance for person B. Now, if you're going to be person B, you'll be duetting with someone that you love in your team or even a Suncorp Team Girl ambassador. So make sure that you watch this nice and closely and it's just like flipping it on the other side this time. So what's going to happen is instead of being the left side of the face to start off with, you're going to be the right. So the frame is going to cut you through the middle of the face with your right side of your face showing to the camera. Then what's going to happen, you're going to jump back, hey, again, and we're going to look to our left. I know, weird, right? We've been looking to our right the whole time. Now we're flicking over to the left. And you're going to point, remembering you don't have the ball to start off with, you're going to be past the ball from a Suncorp team girl or one of your teammates. So you're going to look over and say, you've got this, we know you do. So you're going to point three times before you get the ball. Then remembering they're passing on, we know our goals. So you'll probably receive the ball is on, sorry, you'll receive the ball on, we rep ourselves. So you'll be able to catch it on, we rep ourselves. So you can either have someone passing to you or you can have the ball just outside of camera if you're close enough and flick it to yourself. Just another really cool way of using it just for yourself. And then you get to be creative here. So for me, I was thinking of going through my legs backwards. And then when I get to my position, which is, which is confidence to our core, pop the ball down and then we go into our chant. So it's left, right, up, hands down, up, good. Remember that from last time. Then we're going to stomp left, flick to the right, stomp right, flick to the left. So from here, what you're going to do is actually pick up your ball. So you've got that right here and you can be a little bit creative and come nice and close. And on dream, ha, huh, you're going to shoot above your camera. Now you wanna make sure you don't hit your camera. So be nice and chill with this shot. You can even do a bit of a loopier one if you like, and then power pose and look over to your mate. That is person B. And we're going to show you some of our TikTokers that have been doing it in the background already. Hey, you got this. We, we know, know you do, we know our goals, we rep ourselves. Hey, you got this. We, we know, know you do. We know our goals. We 